Hi there. I'm here to talk about the first um, way of mindfulness walk of this season, which is taking place from Kafatliog on Friday the 1st of April. It's, it's a mindful walk and it's running from 10 o'clock until 4 o'clock. So it's a full day walk, a gentle one, not too, not too strenuous. It takes place around, we'll be doing around five, six miles. And there'll be a climb of about 800, 900 feet. And it's across a variety of different terrain, mainly tracks, woodland tracks like the one I'm walking on now alongside the Avon Cluedog. And slightly rougher tracks old drover's roads and a little bit of metalled road. We'll be going through woodland along open stretches of hillside and onto the hilltops above Kofatliog. On the first part of this walk we're going to be walking out along the side of the Avon or River Cluedog. One of the things I love thinking about when I hear sounds like this is what would the soundscape have been like years gone by? In the times of the drovers I've read that it was very very noisy and they had this strange sound that they made and this is apparently a sound that was passed down and down and down through generations Apparently it doesn't represent, doesn't sound like a word, it doesn't sound like singing. It sounds, you get the sense that it's some sort of really, really ancient style of call. Which I find absolutely fascinating. As we walk along the Avon Cluedog, we'll be passing lovely deep green pools just like this one great spot for meditation, enjoying the bird song, the sound of the water, feeling the sun warming us. Mm. So you join me again and I'm on the quite a different looking part of the landscape that we'll pass through on the Kafatliog walk on the 1st of April. So right up on the tops, we will have had, by this point, we will have had a meditation on the top of a hill called Voilichav, which looks down over the top of the valley. And um, we'll be striding out along what I think may have been a drover's road. And the reason I think that, partly, is because of the, the track itself. It's very, very well defined. And I know that later on, as we, as we walk on, you've got the typical kind of very high sides um, that some of these ancient tracks have. But also, um, something I read about recently in a book about Drover's Roads talks about how the Drover's, the, um, drover's Roads evolved into uh, trackways that typically would have areas to the side between the trackway and the hedges or the walls that was l broad enough to allow the cattle to stand off the track and graze for a bit as they as they would like to do and you've got that here um, and as you'll see when you come on the walk it's it's way it stretches way behind as well so I just I was really pleased to see that out here today okay this point of the walk as I turn round you'll see do a little swizzle you'll see the Klokainog up there the valleys and then the way ahead so I shall be back with you again in a moment. So I hope that's given you a bit of a bit of a glimpse into what this 
mindful walk is going to look and feel like. So again, it's coming up soon on Friday the 1st of April, 10 till 4, starting at Kafatliog. You need to book, booking's essential because there's lots of information that I'll be sending you about the walk. Um, so if you're interested, then pop along to my website at wayofmindfulness.co.uk forward slash events. That'll give you all the information about the walk there and um, how to book. You can also access videos that are on my YouTube channel and they're accessible from my website. So if you want to get an idea of um, what some of the meditations might be like, then um, that'll give you a chance to do that. So I hope to see you on this walk or one of my other walks really soon. Take care and as the Buddha himself said, with mindfulness, strive on.